Okay, Sagittarius. Let's get into this reading. Sagittarius moving to the planet Mars, November 24th. So if y'all feeling a little frisky, <clears throat> I feel like you want to pop off or go into action. Y'all feeling the effects of Mars. Some of y'all may have a high sex drive right now, which doesn't make it better if you don't have anybody to mate with. So don't end up biting somebody's head off because you can't get no sexual healing. Trust that y'all being guided to get away from traditions. Some of y'all struggling with getting away from traditions. It could be religious traditions. To me, it's no getting away from whatever, I guess, raised you up. If you was raised Christian, if you, whatever you was raised to be, it's your roots. A tree springs forth from its roots. There's no limits. You go check out the roots of the tree. You can't tell where it starts, where it ends. <clears throat> it's no limit. As long as you got good roots. You don't want to end up like this girl. Traditions. I think y'all taking it, some of y'all may be taking it a little bit too seriously. Just, you know, follow guidance, inner guidance. Some of y'all restoration is needed. But you feel like you want to pop off? Sometimes. Which? Some of y'all be going to pop off on people on the internet. Some of y'all need to get more into crystals. Or it's time to buy more. Sometimes, to me, crystals, if you have them for a long extended period of time, Ooh, some, of them, let's go. some of them get loaded where they just turn into, you know, regular pebbles outside. <laughs> then some get more juice. But it's time for somebody to either get into crystals or purchase new ones. No recharging, no, no. Nurture. Yeah, y'all go in and out. Oh, Shun energy. Some of y'all are ruled by the, or excuse me, daughters of uh, Oh Shun. Some of y'all go into solitude, but y'all don't want to pop off. Y'all be trying to restore, but it's like something pulling y'all. If y'all been feeling that a lot, lady, it's because of that um, Mars placement. I didn't put when it's going to go into another zodiac sign, so it may be in there for a little minute. Check it out, check it out. Somebody just honked the horn, that was a confirmation. People just pass off their anxiety. I don't go outside a lot. 
People deal with high levels of anxiety. Women, a lot of women. Men too, depending on their um work. I don't know if that was a male person, I don't know who that was, but they got anxiety. Like, no. Uh -uh. You know when it's not yours. If that's a male lady, she needs to quit. If her job causes her anxiety like that. what it is. There must be a lot of perverts on her round or something. She had to quit. <sighs> Some of y'all dealing with the same shit? You can't do but what you can do. Queen of Swords. You hear me? Sometimes you just You gotta let it go. Cause if something got you feeling like that, at some point, let's say you gotta know when to hold them. Know when to fold them. That's not rewarding. You know, I don't feel that when I, when the male uh male carrier, when the guy male carrier, he be told as a kill count. That's ridiculous. Whoever that was, she spent a lot of her time dodging perverts. You got that kind of shit on the job too? That shit terrible. That's what I'm trying to say. Princess of Cups. This is inner child. Petrified. What energy they yeah, man. Okay. Zombies. Where is this going, Sagittarius? Y'all dealing with this kind of shit? Y'all coming out, the philosopher, enlightened, the hermit. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what y'all going through. Some of y'all pushing through some shit. Pushing through some shit. And understanding it ain't nothing outside. You be sleeping outside. Mm-hmm. Some of y'all ain't had an awakening. Women oh, awakening. Let's go. There you go. Let's go. Women in there, they're awakening, and men getting enlightened about some shit. And some of y'all Sagittarius women, men are intimidated by y'all, and y'all don't understand why. I think that could go for any sign. You know, for real. You'd be like, what? Because there's parts of you, like I said, the Princess of Cups, the inner child, is shy. People are going to think I'm a damn whack job. Because you may have a job where you kind of out front and center. Or the persona. You act more out of your star sign, of course, than your moon sign. Moon sign is something your mother know. Your father know. People that's close to you. Yeah, oh, she is shy. And people are like, yeah, right. But it's intimidating. For whatever reason. It's annoying to y'all, though. I can see. I understand Teamwork. If you gotta get other people involved, I mean, it's good to have a sounding board, but if you gotta get people involved to see how you just gonna talk to somebody, I don't know. You know, I don't know. So it could take teamwork for some people. <laughs> get the get the nerve up, and you gotta ask people and involve other people. Oh, y'all ready to pop up? Listen, these doppelgangers, is it weird? Y'all be seeing y'all self on there? On the internet? 
You put doppelganger in your arm. And then some of the men that aren't qualified don't want the doppelgangers. It leaves you covering your inner child. At the same time, trying to get pushed through shyness. You know, trying to get, I understand some of y'all funny. And in the meantime, you're intimidating. Like, what? I'm trying. I'm not intimidating. No, no. I'm trying to get over this stutter, kind of shit. Stammer. But some people just misread. Just, I don't know. It's frustrating nonetheless. Y'all are waking into some shit. Everybody can't handle y'all. But they should be intimidated. You're not getting that. Some of y'all not understanding that. Especially not if you're shy. It's like, what? You got to get to know somebody to know certain shit. And accept them for what it is that you see. Like, people come in variations, you know. Just not one way. All the time. Even though you are, you know. multi -layer. Mm-hmm. Queen of Wands, for sure. See, you got that Queen of Wands. You got this Queen of Wands. <laughs> Fiery as fuck. That's what people say. She's shy. She reserved. Yeah, right. Uh -oh. She's intimidating. Y'all do something with you. Out front. Six of materials. Maybe some form of charity work. Maybe a motivational speaker or something. It's so aggravating because they're reading it wrong. Look at this. It's just a bug, you know. Knock it off. You break up to make up misery. That may be what people are used to. So they don't know how to it's intimidating for a woman that's not a drag. It's intimidating for men to be with women that are not a drag. They used to the makeup and breakup. That's what they used to. So when you come off as bubbly or positive or God-driven even, not a God complex, no. Everything you do, you do with God in mind. You know? That's how you do unto others. You have a high... You have high thinking, high thoughts, quite naturally. It's intimate, it's reading intimidating for some men that are used to makeup to breakups. Y'all could have came out of some makeups to breakups, had an awakening from that shit. This way your hair turns away. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> away from having sex outside with randoms, you know. That's high sex drive, though. It is what it is. Ain't nobody your judge. You just learn. You live and you learn. Like, what the fuck am I doing? Stop that. But I want to eat that. Stop that. <laughs> Somebody wants you to stop telling the truth, or you want me to stop. <laughs> the ones. Somebody that talk a lot. Or well, y'all may be too honest. They scared. So if it's a hard out here, these men is scared, y'all. They used to not talking. They used to people not seeing them. <sighs> kind of like a filler, you know. <laughs> they don't even know, you know. Y'all may be awakening them to different parts of themselves without y'all even realizing it. Maybe through your platform. Maybe you know them and just who you are as a person. It's intimidating, nonetheless, to the male species. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Knave of Wands. It's a Knight of Wands. Just, just kill the ego, why don't you? Why don't you, babe? Kill the ego, why don't you, babe? Now, that's intimidating, along with the other young lady, the charitable lady. 
You got the motivational, happy, high vibing, eating something exquisite, and all they know is burgers and fries. What the fuck is they going to... But people have to realize what the fuck do that got to do with you liking somebody or being attracted to somebody. If you eat potatoes and I eat tomatoes, then we need to make sure we buy potatoes and tomatoes. What the fuck is the big deal? But they did. This person all in their head and you killing their ego. You be killing them. Well, you be killing them. But they be envisioning they self making out. Can I hit it in the morning? Can I hit it in the morning? Sun rising while you moaning. That's what I heard. Funny how men mind work. They can, they can visualize that, but they can't visualize y'all eating separate meals. Five of swords. the hell some of them say y'all had him y'all had him going to jail hell no I can't I gotta go deeper into this cause it's like multi multiple messages you know It may be somebody that, that was around when y'all were in a union and they saw the trickster energy that the person was that y'all was in a union with. That they weren't good enough for you, but you intimidate this person. Could have been a friend of your ex. Could have been a relative of somebody. It's a lying energy. They could be a Leo. I don't know. You see what they saying? In fact, looking, this motherfucker up to no good. This could be you. You know what I'm saying? For real. Not killing you for real. I said, girl, you'll be killing them. <laughs> Somebody was a vibe killer, basically. You know, just not for you. Not for you. A lesson. You know, not a blessing. How they see you. They think they'll go to prison. That's funny as fuck. For being that protective, you know. Y'all is honey. Let me tell you something. They the groupie. What's that song by Usher? I'll be your groupie, baby. Cause you are my superstar. Superstar, yeah. I'm your number one fan. Doing all that I can. <laughs> Show you how super you are. Yeah, this person going through it. These divine masculines. Jesus Christ. Queen of emotions. They see y'all as such lively, Hollywoodish, you know, superstar as energy. Y'all just be being yourself. I mean, on y'all rag day, they see y'all as, you know, this. Oh, let's go. <laughs> like, what? You know? How do you break the ice on some shit like that? They used to make up to break up. They used to, you know. You see, there's somebody that's in their head. They done created problems and obstacles and barriers where they were none. Where they could have just went on here and said. Because for some of y'all, it's somebody that was around when y'all was with somebody else. And they saw it could be somebody you never met before. They're just sitting back watching you maybe post being in a union. And they can see right through the person. Clearly, they got some form of intuition. But they be in the head, too, a lot. Awareness. They're going to have to whoop somebody's ass. <laughs> I'm telling you, they own this. Whoop somebody's ass. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Getting friends involved. Teamwork want to come right back. You know what? I can't. Just funny as hell. Yeah. Charity card showed. I didn't take it. Then the charity card came up in reverse. They aware of somebody that didn't take care of y'all. Somebody that wasn't for y'all. Somebody that was foolish. Somebody that dropped the ball. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Did somebody say dominoes? Possibly could be a twin flame. 
Just people got y'all in separation. You ain't about to go down around a good street sweeping. <laughs> For real. People in this paper leave shit. The devil. A Pisces. Some of y'all could have been with a devil Pisces. You know, they don't know. Was no death to it. Just dick in hand. Excuse me. That's all that you was there for, then. Yeah, this person is... Um, adorning you. They adorn you. A secure person, but they say in their head a lot. Could be a uh, water sign or earth sign. I mean, they stand their head a lot. It's kind of ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous. Is she going to want me? Is she going to call me? Is this really her phone number? <laughs> Damn, homie. Ugh, I know it. Somebody's stealing. That love ain't yours. You know that love ain't yours. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah. People are all over the place with it, Sage. Be careful with that Mars placement because y'all be done popped off. People are all over the place with it. You know, ain't got no business and ain't had no business. And then people that have business won't go ahead and take the opportunity to make you their business. Empress. Single in reverse. Somebody trying to take y'all off the market because they took y'all being played by clowns. They got to get out of their head. They done built all these fucking barriers up. If you sit back watching somebody like this, for however long they've been watching y'all, whether it's watching y'all get played, whether it's watching y'all date duds, whatever the case may be, you know, you can get stuck in that fucking internet shit. You can get stuck in, you know, yeah, pictures of somebody, just looking at somebody on a picture there. The person is right there. All you got to do is say something. But they be done built up all these stories and barriers and obstacles. And then they'll be saying, you're yoke there. That's my wife. That's me right there. But don't make no moves. Friends, if they do have any that they confide in, sick of hearing about it all. Man, you don't say shit there. Shut up. Can't shit. Lord, where they got to play the part at, y'all. Young generation of witches, karmics, Lord have mercy. Three of Wands. Oh, let's go. Oh, they got to deal with them. Either daughters, or oh, they got free. Either daughters or um, exes, too. Talk about starting then ending very fast. The fool, the fool. You get two. You're dealing with fools. Mm hmm. Both of y'all had to get rid of some people. Mm hmm. Witches, warlocks, weirdos. Don't know why they even with you. You thinking it's one thing? Like, am, you know, am I dreaming? <laughs> or it was all a dream and shit. Sued and weirdo. I'm telling you, weirdo. <laughs> Man, shit, party with weirdos. Yeah, ho, yeah, ho. Hell no. I don't pop Molly. I rock time four. Weirdo, messy, God complex. Remember I said that? Y'all not the <laughs> you to had to get rid of a lot of different energies. <laughs> Damn, I promise. This seems like every time I do readings, 
People get rid of people. People that's drawn to my channel, man. Y'all don't have no problem getting rid of some people. For real. Keep the receipts, honey. Let me tell you something. I know what you did last summer. You was not about to be bothering me. Or especially put me in this. And it's supposed to keep on. Uh-uh. Said y'all is not into hurting and shit like that. No, y'all high vibe. Y'all get rid of some shit. I ain't never got the time. I ain't never coming, kind of shit. Mm, well, coming back, should I say? Yeah, this person got hurt by younger people. Could be, like I said, could be their children or could be people they dated that were younger than them. Just same as y'all, Amira, like, you know. Am I dreaming? <laughs> Am I making this all up? Oh, so I just, I played your part and my part. Because the whole time you was just here for the sex and the food. Okay, fine. Kind of shit. <laughs> y'all ain't going through y'all phone reminiscing as you. Hell no. <laughs> Add it up. <laughs> for sometimes. When you dealing with weirdos, you got to go baseline, baby. Go to the root. Okay, let's see. Let's go through these texts and see what this was about. I got to the point. I got, I stopped touching it because I was like, listen, you want some motherfucking trash. I ain't even got to go look at nothing. You know, it's been a minute since I had to go there. You just realize a, a lot of people are in a state of illusion. For real. Dealing with scattered energy. Mental chatter, tons of that shit. Spiritual poverty, delusional fantasies, unrealistic, a distraction, unstable, unattainable dreams. That's what I'm saying. You'll end up being everything that somebody is not, and you'll be it so much, especially by y'all being a big energy like Sagittarius, ruled by Jupiter. You'll, you'll end up thinking that the people that you're around are you too. But it's really just you taking up space. A lot of it. <laughs> and you're like, oh, okay. So I've been doing all this. Okay, this is all me right here. Oh, right. That's when it's time to get rid of people. For real. Yeah, oh, shit. Mm-hmm. Oh, wait. Oh. Whoa. You all got the king of swords in this deck. Mind you, weirdo, seven of cups. These people with these unattainable dreams, goals. Y'all do all the work and think that other people are helping y'all and it's y'all doing everything. And people look like they're just reflective of you, but they ain't really doing shit. You know what I'm saying? Taking up space in the wrong way. Let's say that. Y'all competent, all that. That's crazy that this is an emperor and this deck, and this is a king of swords, but they're sitting on the same type of stable chair. Decided. One got an unk, one got the sword. Some of y'all are going to be decided. This is just coming up. This is this energy is strong as hell. You got the king of swords and the queen of swords to come out back to back in the same damn deck against these type of motherfuckers. Anybody y'all got receipts on, and then the king of wands come up decided. <laughs> that could be male or female, it doesn't matter. That y'all standing together with somebody. And some of y'all don't care if it's really like a faith walk. Because some of y'all do not give a fuck if you don't feel the person, if you're not sure if it's the person that you think it is. You don't care. You got faith that it's all going to work out. For the good and that you're gonna be with somebody because that's where you know you see your life that may be a vision that you had you know what i'm saying a long ass time ago and you stick it to your damn guns on that shit that's it takes faith for real it really do and it could be somebody that's there but they aren't coming in yet but when they do come in both of y'all gonna be decided that y'all ain't taking no shit off no damn body after y'all come out of these weird ass situations, whether it's with friends, families, lovers, it doesn't fucking matter. Co-workers, workers, does not matter. Nine of materials. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Y'all gonna shift after this. 
if you're single, you're going to embrace it a little bit more. It's not easy to embrace singlehood when you do not want to be. It's really not. But then what helps is to think if, if just to think if you're ready, you know, because another person being introduced in your life, all of who they know is going to be introduced into your life. Whoever hasn't fallen by the wayside, it may be a part of their core group of soul tribe or whatever. If you had that same thing or nobody at all, it doesn't matter. You still got to adjust your life in one way or another. You know, we be so quick to want to, but then it's like, it's like, what the fuck, Beyonce, what she say in that song? What is that? What is that shit? As a human being, you know, something got messed up, but we were just supposed to be with who we were supposed to be with. But shit be trippy, man. I'm trying to tell y'all. This is somebody getting out of some trippy shit. You see how she ran through that maze of sorts? Can breathe. Because you all around some weird, you don't recognize these more. Who the fuck is this? I thought it was like this, but you doing all the work to keep y'all like this. They only hold little man, man head on picture day. But they don't do that no other day. Just for example, you know. Yeah, some of y'all in it to win it. Some of y'all in something now. And decide it. Some of y'all may be watching for a Sagittarius, the Libra energy. The Libra female. You don't have no choice. Like, what else y'all gonna do? It ain't nothing else to do. You're doing the right thing. For some people, they make it seem like it's not the right thing to be what God created us to be. And that's man for woman, woman for man, however you do your situation. Companionship at the end of the day. I don't like ship words because they sink. So let's just say somebody you're going to do life with, okay? This shit be getting heavy dark witchcraft seven days a week. This is shit that gets, it throws you and hurls you on into different situations and scenarios you were never supposed to be in. Your life was supposed to take off in another way, but it took off in a wrong way for some of y'all. And you ended up in some weird ass situationships. Some of y'all can breathe coming about that shit, but be careful. <laughs> Weirdos about it. Oh, y'all person come in. If y'all person in, y'all already know. There they go. This is a feminine. I got two magician cards in this deck. This is a feminine doing magic. To get a masculine energy. They point down at Mars, so be careful. Trying to call in a masculine energy through Mars. Be careful if you're a masculine Sagittarius. <laughs> Hell no, it's a Leo. Y'all got Leo in y'all chart. That's a Leo in y'all experience. Just hip to the game like a motherfucker. See a punk bitch fraud. That's what I got wrote <laughs> from my mouth off, okay? Lord have mercy. That's what they're going to end up calling in. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. Some of y'all so sick of these people that's in a union. Y'all good with each other. Y'all fed up with these motherfuckers. You hear me? The hermit card just keep hip to them. Y'all hip to them. If y'all a couple... Y'all is hip to these motherfuckers. Y'all good where y'all at. Why do they try to make like that's not the way that things are supposed to go? Like you're not supposed to be happy with who you with. You're not supposed to want to go to the store. The love ain't supposed to grow year after year after year. That's made up. That don't happen. What happens? Makeups to breakups? You know? And before you know it, you'll be in a situation shit with a motherfucker that think like that. And you don't even know they think like that until you, what, a year in, kind of shit? Fed up. Some of y'all are fed the fuck up. No joke. Whether you're in a union or not, fed up with the whole man, one thing. 
cheating, the why, the this, the that, justice. Y'all gonna get it. Y'all gonna get it. Reciprocity. Hermit again. Keep using wisdom. Some of y'all learn valuable lessons within a union. You know, yeah. Death of a dishonor, basically. A lot of betrayal, a lot of backstabbing, a lot of bullshit connected to people that are in union. You are Sagittarius in union. This is all y'all, y'all, all y'all got, some of y'all. You know, you may even have tons of friends. You may have tons of associates, whatever the case may be. It doesn't matter. Y'all came to the realization that y'all, y'all got. Some people respect that and stay in the confines of wherever they're at and don't come into where y'all at. Right? Like they already know. Look <laughs> at the priest is there. <laughs> oh, Lord. Y'all dealing with some shit, boy. Yeah, man. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It don't matter if this horse is a man or a woman. It don't matter nowadays, honey, because let me tell you something. I ain't even going to go there. But anyway, no life purpose, honey. Running into you, you thinking they like you, and you ain't doing shit but shit, taking up space. They literally will sit there and become you. They like shapeshifters. Only got to be around for a certain amount of time in order to start picking up your mannerisms, your things. And if they've been watching you, oh, shit. You going to take you, me, to you. And then they're going to leave you traumatized. What the fuck? You got to be careful. Out in these streets. Six of Cups. It's time for y'all to give y'all ancestors some offerings. If y'all do any offering, offer them up some tea or something, some coffee, some, anything. It doesn't matter. It's whatever y'all got. This soothing, I guess you could say. A lot of people talking. I mean, they got to get to work. They hungry. <laughs> A lot of talking and chatter going on, honey. You want to see them white hands? Like, give me some, give me some. Can I get some of that? Can I get some? Can I get, can I get, can I get some? Can I get some? <sighs> it's an all hands on deck situation. I'm trying to tell y'all. In the seen and the unseen. Don't let nobody tell you no motherfucking difference. They can call me crazy. They can say, you used to call me crazy, Joe. Now they can call me Batman. Because, honey, let me tell you something. Justice. Y'all gonna get justice. Second time it fell. Y'all gonna get justice. Oh, yeah. Y'all know it, too. Some of y'all know it. They ain't in a union, but feel that you're gonna be in one because you envisioned it, seen it, something. There you go. There you go. Just married. Don't they be honking at horn like that? Somebody working on something. They got to work up their nerve. They don't work up too many obstacles and shit. Ooh, they getting corrected by their ancestors. Transform their energy. Yeah, they don't do that. They're wasting time and space. Oh, no. You know, nobody could even come through. Not that you want them to because... Oh, what the, let's go. Yeah, the crazy part is somebody literally blocking these no life purpose having people from even entering your experience. Some of y'all may have, like, if you go outside or you go somewhere to a club or whatever, get something to eat, whatever, you used to people saying, hey, baby, what's up? Can I get your number? Hey, oh, cutie, you cute? Da, 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 da. That's that fell off. If that's that fell off, don't nobody really say nothing to you because somebody blocking. But it's a good thing, too. <laughs> you know, for real. You don't have any cover. Sometimes you, when you don't have no covering or when some parts of you may be connected to somebody else that still resonate with that type of shit, people will be trying to talk to you all the time. That ain't no flattery. In some cases, when you reach a certain spiritual level of maturity, you don't want nobody saying shit to you. You want to be invisible. You're so glad ain't nobody talking to you. Why Why are you looking at me? Why are you, why are you over there looking at me? Kind of shit. Oh, no, no. I was just... Oh, okay. How you see me? You know? <laughs> what's attracting you to me? What, what's going on? 
Because I don't work myself to the point where nobody say shit to me. A whole bunch of people start talking to you. Unwanted attention, not a vibe, okay? We ain't talking soul tribe. We ain't talking alignment. No. I don't even, you know, deal with that kind of persona no more. These motherfuckers. The no life purposes. Flopping around. Oh, hey. Oh, nigga go, okay. Okay. <laughs> Oh, we should go eat out. We should go eat out sometime. Yeah, we should go get something to eat. Next thing you know, down goes Fraser. Two months later, trying to think you got a friend some damn where. No. Something smell like curdled milk. I don't know what it is. Cause baby, I ain't got nothing out here but some cherry cone. Some spoiled. Some done. Some the done deal. Need to be thrown out. Either for real, for real. Either y'all doing that shit for real, for real. Somebody eat some kind of cheese or something. I don't know. <laughs> but somebody either needs to throw some milk out before you get sick or something is done. You've exhausted all of the possibilities with somebody. So you can't cry over spoiled milk. It's over with. Final decision. Some of y'all with a friendship. Dead as a donut, I bet. Pour it out. You're going to get sick with each other. There you go. Somebody blocking y'all marriage, blocking y'all. I'm telling y'all, blocking y'all from getting a man. What's a lot going on? God complexes, weirdos. That point where you take the picture and then be like, at that moment when everybody's smiling, huh, realize ain't none of them your friend. Y'all ever had that moment? Stand up for yourself. Yeah, some of y'all got to put their light out. They aggressive. They don't think that, you know, you can't tell them, no, you got to be a friend. It's a dragon. Slay them all. Oh, hell no. Turn up. <laughs> y'all in Mars, too. Like escapists. Come home to yourself. Yeah, some of y'all used to escaping. Some of y'all used to escaping. Some of you used to escaping. You can't escape no more. You got to stand up. Especially if you reach a certain point within a union. You're trying to, you know, leave and cleave for real, for real. Like, oh, shit. I got, I got to cut my aunt off? That's when you at the big girl, big boy table. Yeah, yeah, you do. Every hurricane comes to an end. Storm. <clears throat> Stars, you can manifest your every wish. Ooh, somebody to throw that down on the ground, honey. It's a storm coming. You all is not about to be friends oh, with somebody. Cool. Somebody y'all done sat up in the bed with and talked with and wrote visions with, honey. You should not have told your vision to this motherfucker. This motherfucker done felt... Somebody may think y'all gay and y'all ain't and they blocking and y'all think it's just friendship and they trying to get you to lay down, baby. In a wrong way. I'm just telling you. Throw that shit like the slug of wind. <laughs> You're about to have to tell somebody to go the fuck here now. For real. No, for real. No, for real. It did. It's a, it's, a, it's a bitch fire. Stand up for yourself. Somebody that's a little bit too comfortable. Don't get too comfortable. Then future tell us don't get too comfortable. Better not get too comfortable. You can't. 
you always have to keep in mind, even though I'm two dud marriages later, you learn a lot. And you should not take for granted that somebody chooses to be with you every day. You just shouldn't. Because people can walk away at any fucking time. But if they stick there, they stick and they get. I tell my son that. That goes for parents too. People choose to be responsible. People choose to take loving care of you. People choose to listen to you. People, to, people don't, for real, people can up and be like, I'm done with this shit. So you don't want to get too comfortable in that way. We say, you you just keep choosing me, huh? That's that's all right by me. And I'm going to do all right by you. Keep it simple, you know? Because don't nobody got to really do nothing for you. Don't, ain't that what we say? Because it is true. But some people want to. These little tricky people. They're bullies. And they're blocking some of y'all union. And some of them think you gay. Or if you ain't, they want to try to turn you that way because they're realizing... You yearn for somebody. But there, a lot of their energy is blocking that somebody too. You want all your, you want your pathway clear. Uh-uh. No. It's too much shit. No. Especially if this is somebody you're going to be doing life with. And I know we ain't going off into no flings. That shit played out. And let everybody know I said it, okay? It really is. shark. Like I said, they should have made the woman a shark too. Swim away from this situation. But it's because there's somebody that's trying to be, you know, get you to, you know, I helped you out since you ain't got no man. The next thing you know, that's your girlfriend. And you weren't even going for that. You thought it was just your girl. You sharing dreams with and shit. You can manifest whatever you wish. You know what I'm saying? Something else going on. Hidden motives. Swim away from this situation. Spaceship. Don't be afraid to sing. Mm-hmm. Everybody. Why can't everybody just have good energy? You know why it always got to be somebody above the crew or somebody that feel like they're not getting enough or somebody that's there with a hidden motive and this and that and trying to figure out, I don't want to do that. I thought we was friends. That's like played out. Oh, I thought you wanted to do that. Even with men, I'm sure. Morning, the world awaits you. You got your bed back. <laughs> Somebody got their bed back. With you in it. Mm -hmm. Embracing y'all on this. Slay them all. I cannot. Please, God. Oh, yeah. Somebody fucking around creating some storm so y'all don't end up. What the fuck kind of shit? The Misery Love Company crowd. Uh-uh. Oh, we about to get up out of here. It's a... How's that for oh, happily ever no. after? The first card was the storm. So everything y'all telling them, I want my man, I want to be married, I want this, I want to do that, this and you need to dream can come true. Somebody taking y'all shit to do it shit to block you from... That's why y'all afraid to get close to women for some reason. Y'all may have ended up with like soul tribe that you never, like a different, I guess, archetype energy. Just different, not the same old, same old. Uh uh. Some of y'all coming into some alignment about friends that ain't hidden motives, snaky shit. Bullies, hindering progress, causing storms. You tell them this is what you want in your life. They go home right away to create an ending on a nine. Could do some magic with the number nine. 
to end shit for you before you know it. Y'all funny as fuck. Slay them all. You know what? That's the inner child in y'all that I was just talking about with that girl. That's how she should be. Slay them all. The inner child in her that was anxious for being around a bunch of weirdos, perverts, feeling it, picking up on it. Some of y'all ain't picked up on this person. Yeah, y'all gotta let them go. I talked about the tree too. Mm-hmm. And don't get so um I don't know, rigid when it comes to learning things the spiritual in nature. If you're a good person, what are you thinking? Like, what the, you see how crazy that is? Just say you're attracted to tarot cards or you're attracted to crystals and you grew up a staunch uh, Christian or you grew up a staunch Muslim or whatever the case may be. You know you're a good person. You know that. And there ain't no second guessing that. Ain't nobody got to come tell you that. You've lived with you. You've experienced you. You ain't out here harm, harming people, lying on people, being a manipulator. All this old weird shit that people be getting into. You ain't under that seven of swords shit. You ain't on it. Okay. You gonna pick up something that's God's anyway. You didn't make a crystal. So you're going to say you're, you're, the, you're the devil for being attracted to that, a crystal or tarot cards? The only thing that tarot cards are dangerous with, to tell you the honest to God's truth, and this is just for me, is that it'll make you codependent on them. You know, you get lazy. <laughs> and if you're shy, it's really bad. Because sometimes you talk to your ancestors through the tarot. If you're a shy person, know it or not. If you leave home, and of course you ain't carrying out no tarot cards because you understand, okay, some shit. Because I'm telling you, that's the danger. You get lazy brain. Like, people not remembering people's phone number no more because we got cell phones to do with. It's type of situation. Till you get in the situation, you be like, God damn, don't got my cell phone. I can't even remember his number. This is the reason why you should keep up address book or whatever we tell ourselves y'all know the programming you be like to heck if I have my cards and your ancestors be like uh uh you don't talk to me what's going on let's practice gut instinct let's practice talking to us hi how you doing <laughs> when you got your cards you can just you know when you shy I'm super super shy but those people that shy, that's the danger and terror for us type, you know? We may see that we are out there. Hey, girl, I know I can be real dramatic with my birth chart. However, core, straight up shy, shy girl, for real. <laughs> so tarot is a way for me to communicate with my ancestors without having to just, because sometimes we talk without this, you know, you know. You're just talking, chill. But when you go shy, I'm just going to ask. I'm going to ask him through the cards. No, no, no. <laughs> All the shy tarot readers know what I'm talking about. That they take tarot with them in their purse or they man bag. All right, y'all. If you're feeling the vibe, please like, share, and subscribe. Love and like.